Hello and welcome to an all new stream with SnowRunner. We're back with SnowRunner and time to do some trucking, some hauling. I hope everyone is doing fine and is doing well. And we're going back to the Yukon area and trying to bring our gold mining operation back online or back on track maybe. And um, last time which is uh, quite some time uh, ago, which was quite some time ago, a um, couple of weeks, we finished our conveyor belt section one. And this one was around here. And now it's finished, which means we can now, if I remember correctly, we could drive through now, right? That was the big advantage now. We now can traverse this bit. Uh, so yeah. logically, there's no other chance than um, continuing with the second one. So conveyor belt section two, that's the task for today. And for that we need two concrete blocks, which I have no clue on where to acquire those. Uh, four small pipes, they could be a headache, I don't know. Uh, wooden planks are probably the easiest ones. But uh, that's for us to find out where we grab that stuff because... Wait, there is a sawmill there. What could this one provide? Let's let's check that first before we go into frenzy. They that one gives wooden planks. Okay, but the the route up there is extremely annoying, right? I know we had heavy difficulties on getting there. That's for sure. Even with the toughest vehicles. I think we went this alternative route to get up there, right? I think it was like that, and then. Went over here and then over. Yeah, it was it was quite a way. So, but that's um, that's a source for wooden planks, at least for some. There's wood framing. What what does those wood framing jobs? Give? They give wooden planks as well. Okay, that's good. So uh, we might just go down to what's the warehouse? Sorry, guys, we need to check what's what because I have no idea what we can get somewhere. There are small pipes two times. Okay, I don't know how much or how often we need those. There's the railway station. What? Where's that warehouse? There's another warehouse. Oh, there's concrete slab. Ooh ha. Okay. Um, this could be good or bad. There's another warehouse. There is cement, fuel, metal beams, small pipes. Does it mean they provide them? Without restrictions, maybe? Or is it just one left? Concrete slab. There's another warehouse. Okay, they have metal beams nearby, so let's let's do a bit of research first and see how many of those um, metal beams they have for us. Because if they get um, unlimited, then we might you grab the uh, small pipes from the other one. No, not that one. That one over there. We could get the small pipes from over there. The way up there is uh, one of the betters. So that will be doable. Here's the lock station. Oh, there, there's wooden planks lying around. There is a lock station where we could go, right? Or did we just lost them there by accident? Oh, wooden planks. Look at that. And there are wooden planks. Okay, so we could get wooden planks there. Oh, right. These are the smaller ones. And then there are the big lock stations where you get the, the heavy locks. Okay. Maybe we could get some more of these. But we should bring down those wood framings first. There's a the concrete plant. Okay. I think we need to deliver something for that first, right? We should check this out as well. Uh, so let's grab one of our trucks and first head over there and then head to the warehouse to make sure how it's uh, on the on the limits of our resources over there and then we start hauling things to our conveyor section number two okay so much for that yeah i hope everyone's fine I hope everyone had a great day or has a great day whichever time zone you are um for us, it's getting dark here, so summer is slowly vanishing already, I think. Which is a bit, uh, which is a bit sad, to be honest, but, um, yeah. That's it. Okay. Um, 
which one do we take? Truck store? No, storage. That's the one. Do we... Wait, I, I need to take a short look at my cheat sheet to find out how big small pipes are. There is a pretty huge, um, yeah, how should I pull it? Um, an overview on what size, what, what cargo is. And that comes in handy, especially when you plan for what, or what you need to transport and whatnot. So small pipes are apparently size two, so they consume two cargo slots. Well, that sucks. Because <laughs> that means we have to go a lot of back and forth even uh, for that alone. So we might end up using our big Western Star again. But not for the research, I would say. Let's go with the Taiga. I think it's, it's a good one. Let's head out there. Let's get going. No, wait. Yeah. Where's that one? Over there. All right. Okay, let's head out. Lots of smoke. So yeah, um, if you got any questions, um, yeah, feel free to ask. I try to provide help for whatever I can. And apart from that, please sit back and enjoy the show. Doing a chill snow runner session. Right, that's what I expected. You need to deliver cement to get one concrete block. And two for one concrete slab. Interesting. Okay. What what were we expecting? We're in the concrete plan. Let's check that first. Okay. So they can produce infinite amounts if we can deliver them. So now comes the big question. Uh, where do we get that stuff from? There's 10 cements over there. So we could do our concrete slabs over there. But right, let's check that uh, metal beams first. We need two, right? It's one warehouse. Wait, let's check further. Railway station. Cargo containers. There's some concrete slabs. Two, two of them. Two of them down there. Rolled steel factory. Yeah, that's what I was expecting. Metal framing. Trailer store. Brick framing is clear. Cabin construction site. Okay, needs a cabin. No, no, provides a cabin. It needs probably, I don't know, cargo container, something like that. Cabin zones, these are the gateways. Okay, there's some upgrades left. Oh, we need to collect those, for sure. Later on. Okay, let's check further. What do we need later on in that area? Oh boy. Reinvigorating the old mines. That's a lot of stuff. Con four concrete slabs. This will be a big one. I don't think we get this done in one session. Okay, but we could save the concrete slabs from over there for this. But we do not need to deliver cement, right? It's always the, the refined good then later on. Mabel section 3. One concrete slab for metal roads. Oh boy. Metal roads. 
more sorting center. <laughs> wow, okay. Deliver to ore sorting center. Deliver to Wait, they're step by step, right? Oh boy, you gotta be kidding. And one cabin, okay. <laughs> okay, factory main block. Okay, factories over at Big Salmon Peak. Final check. Okay, those are those heavy trailers, right? Okay, no one is over there. And the other one? He's over here. Oh, look at that. Okay. Okay, cool. Ah, uh, great. So, no cement is actually needed. Concrete blocks. We could use the cement and bring it over there, right? Okay, we still don't know what we need for cabin, but we'll find that out later on. But it's not important for today. So let's get back. Uh, railway station. There we can get more consumables, which is good. Concrete blocks is good. Concrete slabs, cool. Okay, we'll leave them there because we need them later on. There's our concrete plant. Wood framing wall. Jeez, you need to, you need to bring down those houses to get rid of all those markers. That's for sure. So I guess we... Start. No, we wanted to check out the warehouse down there, right? So this has some metal rolls on it already. This seems to have everything. Without restrictions. So we should check out this one as well. This one as well. I don't trust those. Okay, we check those two and then we're ahead on to delivering the goods that we actually need to deliver. Okay, let's check. Two left. Metal rolls for small pipes. Fuel, cement. Ten left. Metal beams. These seem to be unlimited there, right? Two cargo left? Because they don't have the cargo left down there. So we could acquire metal beams all night long from that one. It would be pretty awesome if you could rename that warehouse to Metal Beam Delivery or something like that. But it doesn't matter. Okay, metal rolls. They will all come in handy very well. Small pipes. 
Yeah, I think we could take them as well, right? Small pipes, four. Concrete blocks. What were the blocks, actually? Were the blocks the big one? No, they were the small ones. Okay. No, we don't need the slabs for that one. Well, that's, that's convenient. This should be doable in a reasonable amount of time, hopefully, today. I don't know. I don't jump now. Okay, so we get two small pipes over there. We get small pipes over there. Okay, we check out that warehouse. And we could already do that with the right kind of vehicle. So then we could collect the wood framing thingies. And bring them over to the uh, conveyor section number two. Cool, let's do that. So we recover with you. And take out the big boy. Because this one gets four wooden planks on it. And that's what we need to deliver. So let's head out there. Alright, let's check. Bricks seem to be unlimited. Metal rolls, two. Small pipes, unlimited. Boy, look at that. Fuel, unlimited. Oh, what's happening? Game just stuck for a moment. Nothing too serious, I hope. And cement. Unlimited amounts of cement. Two metal beams, consumables. Also unlimited. Okay, that's uh, good to know, to be honest. Um, do we go with small pipes from the start on? No, we go with the wood. Let's grab the wood. Okay. So 
let's check again. Where do we need to go? There is oh, there is one wood framing as well, but we don't go there with the car we have. Or with the truck. It's a metal frame. Okay, so we need to go down there. Do we get there from over here? Should be possible, right? And then we grab that one as well. There was one in the... No, there's, there's just metal and brick framing. Okay, that's okay. Good. Let's do those two. Then we should have our four wooden planks packed up and ready for delivery. I hope this goes well down there in the, near the water. Auto saving mechanism that seems to kill the kill the whole PC there. It doesn't continue like that. Is it snowing there? Oh yeah. Wow. Let's get it. <laughs> Looks a little bit like we erased that building. Well, it is what it is, right? Can we get up there? Whoa! What was that? Oh yeah, we officially get some uh, cargo, so um, turn on the beacons, right? Don't know how deep that is. Looks painfully deep. We'll be fine. Once the back is fully in there, the front should go already out of it again. Yeah, it's rising. Slow but steady. Slow but steady. That wasn't the smartest idea. Okay. Well, take your time.
All right, there we got it. Fully loaded. Wow. Used up quite some fuel. We don't need to go that far, is it? It's just two kind of tricky bits. That's no, nah, not that one really. That one is a bit tricky, and then we need to get that turn over here. That will be the most trickiest thing, I think. And just don't tip over. All right. Okay, run. Let's get going. I was expecting it. I was so much expecting that. <sighs> Why? Doesn't matter. I know why I have my crane right here. <laughs> okay, rescue operation on the go. Where are they on? No, they aren't. No, they're on. I hope that this isn't a big deal. Just put them back up on its feet and... Um, put in the cargo. place might be a bit stupid for that, but apart from that, it's not too far off in some very crazy, cranky, small space where you can really maneuver and um, need to watch where you go and all that. Obviously, you should look where you go. I mean, if I had, I wouldn't have <laughs> tipped over, but... <laughs> ah, yeah. I think it was a bit too fast. But that's bad.
We'll have to switch over to the P16 or something like that. Because he never failed over. Um, more just one or two times with some really, really heavy cargo on there. But apart from that, it's so wide. I kind of hate the den. I don't know why. It felt a lot better in the, a year before, but... Seems a couple of updates later. It's not performing that well anymore. I don't know. I'm just remembering shit. It seems to be completely useless now in... in those swampy, muddy areas. Which is a bit odd. Especially since he got those big mud tires. Let's check that. Activate anchor. Why does that never work? I found that out. Uh, what the hell? Oh, that's that's the, okay. We should get the lower one. Can we? Can we do that? Okay, um... Let's try something different then. That's it. Oh, Can't even see the underground there. What the hell is, is there? I should have just destroy the truck and then put on the cargo. The cargo is the one that I can't retain easily. The truck would be no deal. Okay, wait, it. we do it like that. Ah, uh, where is it? Shoot. Change the truck. You know what? Like that.
was expecting that. <laughs> but anyway. Alright, everything's back on there. I think we can just pull through there. Okay, yeah, sometimes it's easier to just go straight. <laughs> It's not that far anymore, right? That small flooded area in the bridge and then sharp left. Get a bit upwards again. And we should be there already. Right. was the right one. Okay. Do we see the difficulties over here? No, not again. Not again. No, 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 no. Who the hell designed those tracks? What? All that is holy. Well, here's me talking to you. This would be an easy task. Turns out I lied badly. Maybe not? Wow.
We go a bit slower with this one. So there's definitely a route for shorter vehicles than that one. Or at least wider vehicles. Ah, uh, no, 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 not on the final meter here. Okay, we got those delivered. Concrete blocks, two. Small pipes, four. Oof, I know the small pipes are pretty heavy, I think. But, first run clear. Okay, next one will be warehouse. That one down there, right? Um, nope. Nope. That one. So we could bring over all that cement, right? Do we get out there without just crashing everything? Huh. Should be possible. Okay, let's do that. And again, head on. And now we bring over that cement over to the factory to make ourselves some um, concrete blocks.
And we're beached, right? We're probably beached, yeah. We're getting a bit. Okay, I think those, right? Let's say two. We need two for that. Okay. Okay, cool. Great. Um, we don't do it with that one. We'll recover you and we take... No, there was... Wait a minute. That was the wrong one. We could take the tiger, but I think we should take something different there. That's a delivery route that nearly everyone can do, so we should take one of those that we don't take very often, maybe. P16, Terry Longhorn. Off roaders. Let's take one of those. Did he got my tire? Chained? Paystar. Oh yeah, let's take one of those. Yeah, that's a good one. Let's take that, Betty. I did one out quite some time. The old military wrestler. Drifting in there. Wasn't perfect. Okay, uh, one, two. All right, there we go. These are the two that we need to get there. Let's get going.
Then we got rid of that rock. <laughs> oh, there was everything on, right? Yeah. Okay, let's get down there. This time without flipping, hopefully.
All right, that was the concrete blocks delivered. They're all empty. Some sun rays through the woods. Okay, uh, so let's recover with that one. Big question now, do we get with a big one? Or don't we? So we get two over there and we got two over there, right? That was it, I think. Small pipes as much as we need. And just the two of them. Okay, so let's get out there first, grab the two, deliver them, and then the second run. Right, that's how we do it. Uh, let's leave the garage. Four. Right. Let's head out there. Shoot. Okay, that's quite heavy. <laughs> Sank down on the back quite a quite a bit. But anyway, these are the first two. And let's bring them in. I'm pulling one piece, and uh, yeah, without rolling. <laughs> But sometimes this extra weight uh, also helps keeping a balance and keeping the vehicle stable, so I don't know, maybe it's even helpful. Guess we'll see that in the run.
Okay, that's delivery one of the small pipes complete. Um, yeah, that that path is uh, quite fig figgly. Lots of places where it's ideal to tip over to lose all the cargo to the environment. Um, that's not what we want to do. Okay, so now second and last run, hopefully for today, um, from that warehouse, last two small pipes. So let's recover and restart, shall we? Let's get going. Okay, there they are, last two. I do hope we can go through that way. Or should we maybe even try that path? I don't know, I think they both don't look very cool, but we have to choose one or another either way, so let's give it a go. Maybe they'll even surprise us. They're not as bad as we think they are.
Okay, that went to uh, quite a little. Wasn't as bad as I thought. Steady. Right. Should not be forgotten. This is extremely bad to go at night.
Okay, final stretch. I see the drop off zone already. I'm crawling there. <laughs> Literally crawling. Come on there, big guy. Push forward. A little bit further. I think we're there already, right? Let's do this. Here we are, contract completed, gold mining started, available section number two. Section two is complete. What about the remaining two sections? Oh, wow, okay. So I think it was mistaken. Uh, um, now there's no way to traverse there anymore. Same with over here. I mean, there's nothing here to traverse, so I don't think it's necessary. But, yeah. Now it's definitely not possible anymore. Don't think we can get over there here, right? Or is it the third one? Wait a minute. Was that the third one? It was the third one. Okay, so we still can get over there. But God knows for how long. <laughs> Metal rolls. Okay. Metal rolls. Bricks are easy to acquire. We can use the brick uh, framings for that. Got one over there and another one up there. And then we got one concrete slab. We got enough cement over here to produce one of those. And then we need four metal rolls. They will break my neck. Okay, warehouse. Metal rolls, only two. Okay, so we should get those from up there to delete it over there. And we can get unlimited bricks from that one. That's cool. Okay. Let's try to demolish all the houses first. There's another brick framing. Okay. Well, maybe we'll get that one first. Brick framing. Two bricks out. Demolish that one. And maybe like that one. We, don't, we needed four, right? Could activate it already. We need to assemble conveyor section near the sorting building. Warning, conveyor section will partially obstruct the path. Also, the cabin zone one needs to be outfitted with prefab cabins. Where's that cabin zone over there? Oh, it's up there. Okay, look at that. Okay, we need one cabin. Cabins at railway station. Cabin construction site. Is there any other? Rolled steel. What? On earth was the rolled steel factory. Yeah, it's the one for the metal rolls. Okay, I got it. Shit, we should have checked what we need for that. <laughs> but anyway. I think we can get that um, figured out in the in the next session. Maybe do a bit of offline research to um, find out what we need. So there's a cabin. Can we actually grab that cabin? No, it belongs there, right? So no way to steal that cabin and bring it to the other one. Cabin zone two. Okay. But it, it seems doable. I don't know how to get over there. There seems to be a path over here. We should be able to do that. Bricks easy, concrete slab easy, metal rolls, no idea. And the cabin could be a hassle.
I don't know. But we'll find it out in the next session of SnowRunner. I'll now recover that one. Um, yeah, that was that was fun. That was not that extremely complicated. And um, doable, to be honest. Where's the global map? That one. So we got a lot of tough regions uh, before us. Is there red Wisconsin? And especially Amur are those who are really, really tough. And then it's supposed to get a little bit easier step by step. Or at least kind of, let's say, kind of. Uh, they then stick to a certain scheme of difficult. And it's not as extreme as Cola, Yukon, Wisconsin, and especially Amur. At least that's from what I read. All right, everyone. We call it quits for today. I thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I would love to see you all again the next time. Um, probably on Friday. And we will probably go out for another Valheim action. And maybe we can close in on the, um, the boss enemy of the planes. Maybe we take a look at that one. Or we do a little bit more of exploration. We haven't find out yet. We haven't decided. Something like that in between. A little bit exploring and then we try to research the area around that um, boss enemy of the planes. So yeah, again, thank you all very much for watching. Please do take care and uh, see you on the next one. Bye bye.